It's always a good idea to change your oil according to the service manual. But when I bought this bike, I asked the guy when was the last oil change he did. He, sc he scratched his head. So that was kind of a sign for me. But he never did that. Well, look at the color. It's really dirty. So the oil filter is here and it looks like this. I just got it from South Korea from a dealership. If anyone needs it, let me know. Send me an email, I'll let you know how to get it. There are a bunch of websites in South Korea. They ship it to LA. And the oil drain plug is here. So this scary looking bolt. This is the one you need to un unscrew. It has been working for probably about five seven minutes. That's more than enough. So now the oil is hot. Just make sure to wear gloves. These things should remain yours, so it's a bolt, a spring and a screen. Put it together and screw it back. On the other side of a motorcycle you will have the oil filter cover, so just wipe it, wipe it clean, make sure that there is no cracks in the rubber, and there is a small spring that goes inside of the oil, oil filter housing. Make sure it's there. The oil I'm going to use is 10 W1040, uh, uh, probably the best oil for California because the 40 stands for the highest temperature it can cope. It's 40, uh, 40 degree of Celsius, and the W10 is is the lowest degree, which is minus 10 Celsius. There are also 5 W, which is I believe minus 15 or minus 20 Celsius and it can be up to 50 which is like plus 50 Celsius and also this thing the heavy duty oil sta stabilizer so I will use it today but if you have ER just go ahead and use that because that is way better than anything else.
just measure somewhere around whoa that's really oily well I'm looking at a hundred milliliters which is roughly 10% of one quad that's gummy there okay that's really gummy